What's up guys? Um, first video ever. Um, just delved into buying my second Vision Komodo grill. Um, wanted more room uh, from the classic B series that I bought back in 2015. And I tried to search and search and search for any background on a Icon 900 series uh, as far as size and just how it looked in person uh, before I actually spent that much money that I spent on this grill. Uh, I wanted to have like the same type of space that you would get with a extra large egg because I think the B series is kind of equal to uh, the green egg large version, right? But I didn't want to spend big green egg money because as you know, you get nothing with the big green egg. You just get the egg and then your price effectively goes up and up and up as you had a cart or a lava stone or all those other things that you really need to be ready to grill. So love my first B series vision. Um, wanted to stay with the brand. Um, I had my own feelings about the customer service from when I first bought to now. Uh, but I am pleased that I purchased this grill um, recently. And on their website, it says that it takes 10 to 12 business days for them to get to your shipment. But my shipment actually delivered today. So I want to say that was maybe seven days of wait. That's business days and a weekend. Uh, seven days from the point of order to now. So what I have uh, currently <clears throat> came in two separate packages. I've already taken the box off the top, but this is a pretty large box. Um, just for reference, uh, try to stand next to it. But I'm 6'6". Six, six. This is the grill. Size of the box. And I also took advantage of, they got a promotion right now that with uh, any Komodo grill you buy, you get a free game day grill. Uh, so I took advantage of that promotion uh, and got the black game day grill. So we'll see how that is. They delivered it all together. Um, hopefully that'll come in handy. Um, so this is the, the box. Uh, pretty well packed. Uh, didn't have any issues when they delivered it. Um, all one piece. Um, when you first open it up, this is the top portion. And up top, you get your owner's manual. Uh, a little attention, how to return, how to contact customer service. And on the very top, again, very well packaged, we got the with the 900 series, you got the uh, side tables, uh, but they're the stainless steel ones to go with this version. And that's just the top box. And I want to say this box has the actual stand cart in it that needs to be put together before we start assembly. So I'll get to that next. All right, so now let's get to the actual box. I want to make sure nothing's cracked. This is a very fragile grill. One of the best grills to grill on, but also very fragile. And I opened up. Oh. All right. All right, so I'm happy. I'm happy because without me actually being able to see this grill in person, I can already tell from the top of it, it's bigger than my B-series. I mean, I look at it on, like, like it on camera, but I can definitely tell it's bigger. So I'm very happy. I'm gonna pause, get some of this packaging out the way, and then take some of this, uh, well, so we can get a better look at it. And I mean, I'm, I'm gonna catch with some of this. I am, I'm impressed with how they packaged it. Um, this is pretty big. Uh, the guy that delivered it said it's like 500 pounds. Um, but they packaged it very well. Um, got the electric fire starter in there, down in there with it. It's a great item to have included. Another thing you wouldn't get with the big green egg. Have to buy that separately. We got the uh, 
It's like the lava stone. It's down in there on the side. But I mean all the way around. Got actually that kept it from being you know bumped and let's see what's down in here. Something I cannot grab. Alright, we'll leave that and come back to it. Whew, it's gonna be a booger getting it out of this box. This is the final product. And again, can't really have a reference, but I'm going to compare this one in its fully assembled glory to Old Faithful, resting on a grill cart that I gotta finish putting together, put some doors on it. But uh, that's my one from 2015, the B series, the OG. Uh, still, still cranking out good food. Um, so I'll start here, right? And, and then also before I even get to that, I had a question that I sent the customer service if uh, the quick change insert would work with the Icon 900 series. Didn't get an answer, but it's pasted to the grill itself. So that is another great option that I'll be able to use if I wanna go and get the insert um, and swap that out uh, and go gas along with my charcoal smoke. All right, so I'm gonna just lift this up, don't judge. Uh, I just did a cook last night, did a pork belly. Uh, but I want to show you in comparison so dead center across on this one you're right at about real cooking space about 18 and a half okay and that's plenty uh, for doing what I need to do for normal dinners stuff like that but here lately I've been trying to do like two briskets right and each one I do for a minimum eight hours uh, and that's a lot of time to take up a grill space. So that was part of the reason for giving this one was to have more room. Uh, and as you can see, got the dual level uh, grill grate on top of the iron grill grate. And I got my lava stone down there on the bracket. Uh, and this one is way easier. Um, you got the fire starter insert and this whole piece lifts out so I can change or take out the uh, ash where I didn't have that option on, on the OG All right had to scoop everything out of that small uh, opening right there so glad to have that option but uh, back to size comparison go to this one Again, dead center. I go from 18 and a half up to 22. So very happy about that. My next test is gonna to be to see if I can place two briskets on here at one time. Now, of course, when they're raw and they go on, um, they're pretty big, the ones I get. Um, and as they cook, of course, they shrink up. And I just, you know, I want to have the opportunity to be able to cook two at one time. I mean, of course, now with the setup, I can do hopefully two on the 900 and maybe one on here or do ribs on this one and still be doing briskets. So I'll do one brisket on here and do however many slabs of ribs on this one or fish, salmon, whatever, what have you. So let's see. All right, so here is the ultimate test. I've got two frozen briskets here. Um, so we got one that is a 14.12 pound brisket and one that is a 14.76 pound brisket. Now frozen, they made it. Uh, throwing out, I mean, they'll rest down a little bit, right? But they're still, they're on there. I could probably finagle them once I get them trimmed up, seasoned and th thawed out before I put them on. But let's see if we can close this thing. Let's see if we can. I am. Oh. Hey. Happier than a dog in heat. All right. So I'm happy. Um, if there's any questions, this is my first video. Uh, but this is something that I really uh, was dead set on doing. It might not be the best video. I mean, I know it's not. But um, I wanted other people to have the opportunity to have some type of information as far as like size comparison, um, 
and what they're getting if they got an older model, how much more space they're going to be getting. Um, and I am very pleased again as far as build quality, uh, ease of putting it together. Of course, the, the hardest part was moving this uh, from point A to point B. It was actually on my living to my front porch, and I had to get it through the house uh, back to my patio. Um, so, worked out. Any questions? Hit me up in the comments. Uh, if you want to talk bad about my patio, I mean, you can put that in the comments too, but I'll ignore you. If you want to talk about my grill that I didn't clean after my last cook, you can. I'll ignore you. Uh, but that's it. I uh, got the light on here. Comes with it. Can't wait to use that at night. Again, this does work with the uh, quick change gas insert. Happy about that. Um, all that stuff you know. It also comes with a cover. So I'll be making sure I put on that. Um, pretty sturdy. Pretty sturdy. Got the uh, op little open at the bottom. Got my starter and my pit work down there. But I'm ready for the first cook. But this is the Icon 900 Grill Series. And again, I am pretty pleased with the amount of room. I am going to be cooking up a storm. Appreciate it, guys.